Hi, my name is Felicia Gath. I'm a part of the Instructional Technology team here in East Baton Rouge Parish School System. And today I'm going to show you how to create a QR code. Now, this is one of the hottest topics that we present when we share out with teachers during our professional development. So today I wanted to give you a very quick video on how to create a QR code. So for most of our presentations, we usually provide two ways to access our presentations to our audience. We provide a bit.ly, which is like a URL, and then we also uh, usually provide a QR code so that they can just quickly use their phone and scan it so that they can have access to it. So let's see how you would create a QR code. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the top right hand corner of my screen with our three little dots, which we can sometimes refer to as our snowman when we're talking about littles. And so I'm going to click on those three dots and then I'm going to scroll down into the new menu that just popped open all the way down to where it says cast, save, and share. Once I hover over those that tab, it is going to open another window. Once I slide over to that new window that has opened under the section that says share, I'm going to go all the way down to where it says create QR code. I'm going to click on that and there you go. So there are two ways that you can do this. You can copy it and share it or I can download it. So I first did copy, so all I have to do is paste and resize it using these little uh, squares on the sides of the QR code to make it the size that I would want it. Or I can go to where I downloaded it, drag it onto my presentation and Here's the QR code again, and then all I would have to do is resize it. So that is how you would create a QR code. And QR codes are so great because you can use them for videos to share with your students. You can record yourself uh, doing a voiceover, a read aloud. You can have it as a way to uh, have an exit ticket for your lesson, uh, for a Google form, pretty much anything. You can use it as a QR code to share, them, share with them resources that you have available somewhere or to a specific website. So QR codes are a very handy dandy tool to have in your toolbox. So hopefully this will help you in the future when creating activities that you will also take the jump into the QR world.